the Lord was speaking to me and, say, and reminding me. Y el Señor me estaba hablando a mí, me estaba recordando. When, um, when you fall in love. Cuando, with, cuando te how many are married? ¿Cuántos están casados? Amen. Amen. Do you remember when you first fell in love? ¿Te acuerdas cuando te empezaste a enamorar con tu pareja? You were ready to run and answer that phone. Listo para correr, para ir al teléfono. Get all beauty up. Te Hello. Hello. And the Lord reminded me when you have, when you're in love with Him. El Señor me recordó cuando love estás enamorado con we're él. We're ready to be in His presence. Estás listo para estar en su presencia. His word says we must worship Him in truth and in spirit. Su palabra dice que tenemos que adorarlo en espíritu y en verdad. We're just vessels out here in the flesh. Somos nomás instrumentos. Worshiping and singing. Nomás adorando y cantando. But we need to, even when you're singing the words, meditate on Him because He's the Spirit. Now, don't look at us. The Lord, as, as we grow older in grace, y cuando crecemos más, más as we're growing older in grace, as we get older in grace, the Lord keeps reminding me many times when they say sing, you don't sing, and you got the energy to sing. El, el Señor me recordó que cuando nos dicen, nos dicen que cantemos, no cantas, pero tienes que cantar. You have to worship him with all your, all, you, all that you have tienes, right now while you can. Tienes que adorarlo con todo lo que tienes ahorita que puedes. It's not promised tomorrow. Porque mañana no está prometido. None of us, all, we all got our days and we don't know when it, when it is. Todo nuestro día está por venir pero no sabemos cuándo es. When we were out in the world, we would, el mundo, we would worship, put, I mean, football, even now you turn it on, I bet you'll see a lot of, hey, ooh, ah, you know. Nobody even has, you don't even have to have a cheerleader out there to say. That's how we should be rushing into the house of God. We have to come with the heart of expectancy. Amen. Expectativa. I just wanted to share a word. Quiero compartir una palabra. En Isaías 61, 3. Isaías 61, 3. Dice: Para darles a ellos una corona de belleza en vez de ashes, el oro de la gladness. Así que quiero decirles que no importa lo que estás pasando ahora, puedes estar orando por tu familia. Te quiero animar a que lo hagas por lo que estás pasando, que si vas orando por tu familia. You might be uh, praying for a situation. A lo mejor estás orando por una situación en tu vida. For a marriage. To, to a matrimonio. A rebellious child. A un niño que está siendo rebelde. Finances. Las finanzas. Sickness. O enfermedad. You might have had something happen to you. You might have gotten raped, molested. A lo mejor te sucedió algo a ti. You might have been on drugs. O estás en drogas. You might have been told you're no good. You don't have a future. You've been rejected. Ha sido rechazado, rechazada. Even as you're a Christian now, your parents still, your loved ones, your family doesn't accept you. Y ahora como cristiano, tus familiares no te reciben, no te aceptan. But we serve a mighty God that all that is covered under the blood. Servimos a un Dios que es perfecto. Grande y maravilloso. I just want to let you know that there's, that Everything that you go through, there's a reason. The beauty for uh, ashes for beauty. Sometimes we have to go through a situation in order for God to show up. If you are sick and God doesn't show, if you're not sick and you want healing, I mean, how do you know He did it? Right? I'll use Joseph. Joseph was a, a chosen one. We're all chosen, and Joseph went through a situation where. He got thrown in the pit by his brothers, right? Por sus hermanos. But God's word says that he don't even turn around what the enemy tries to do because his own brothers took him out in order for him to continue to go forth. Amen? So it doesn't matter what you're going through. Pero no importa lo que estás pasando tú. God will make a way where he will be glorified. Amen. 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 Amen.
Amén, aquí tenemos testimonios de los profetas que están al colegio y, y el Dios ha privado por todas las necesidades, por todos los finances, por la casa y la comida y todo. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Vienen a adorar al Señor. Vienen a darle gracias. Vienen porque se levantaron y respiraron. Muchos de ustedes pasaron por cosas. I'm human and I go through things every day. Every day. I go through things every day. Do anybody, is anybody else going through things? Work. Family. En la familia. Con el esposo. Wife. Con la esposa. Children. Con los hijos. Finances. There we go again. Ahí vamos otra vez. And as you continue to, as we continue to go through this, we're going to focus on God. Amen. Continuamos a pasar por eso, tenemos que enfocarnos en Dios. Because he says he will never leave you or forsake you. Porque él nos dice que él nunca nos deja ni ni nos desamparará. Amen. Amen. So yo le doy gracias al Señor por todo lo que está haciendo. I give God thanks for everything that He is doing. And don't lose hope. Y no pierdan la esperanza. Amen. Because His word never returns back void. Porque su palabra nunca regresa vacía. Sometimes we uh, forget. There's a scripture in some says, "Forget not His benefits, where you know where He's brought you from." A veces se nos olvida, pero hay una escritura en los salmos que no olvidemos sus beneficios. He's healed you from all your diseases, diseases. Él nos ha sanado de todas nuestras enfermedades. Amen. Sometimes we forget because we get caught up. He heals us and we, you know, it says in the word that some people got healed and they didn't turn back to say thank you but one person. We have to make God as our personal, our personal Lord. And not, you know yeah. those little boxes that roll like this? Como una cajita que le dan cuerda y que algo When you feel like seeing it, oh, I think I need something from God to let me go in. Or then the dead arises. I need uh, another little sweet anointing. I need to see what I can do. God can do for me today. Luego cuando el muerto resucita, vamos y corremos a Dios. Y dice, ¿qué va a hacer por mí hoy? And then when he gets it, then he goes back out to the ground. He gets dry again. Y luego cuando lo recibe, entonces se va otra vez a a a la tierra. Well, it goes back to a la tumba. Not the land of the living, but goes back to whatever situation. Se va, se, se va atrás a donde estaba antes. So I just ask that you continue. When y'all come into the house of God, y'all come with your hearts prepared to Ven, worship Him. Vengan con sus corazones listos para adorarle. Even if there's ten people, sometimes we come to services before. Solamente hay 10 personas. Hay veces que ha habido servicios que nomás hay poquito. Don't get discouraged. No, se, no dejen que Amen. el ánimo se les caiga. Amen. You come to praise the living God. Amen. 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 We don't know how, we don't know when, but he's going to do it. He's going to provide the musicians, he's going to provide everything that we're needing. Amen. 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 Amen.